today so glad to be with Corrado Pozzer, CEO of Technopack. How was this edition for you of Ipakima? First of all, I would like to say that it is uh, really a pleasure to be again in exhibition and to do our job uh, as we did uh, for uh, many years since ever in the life. Uh, so the pandemic has been uh, able to change uh, drastically many things around our business. Uh, and suddenly when uh, we knew that Ipakima will happen, so beginning of 2022, we said to ourselves, uh, what will be going on? It was difficult to to understand, but uh, after four days here, I have to tell you that I've been quite impressed about uh, the quick uh, way that uh, the world had to be as it was always in the past. So I have seen many customers. We have been able to have at the booth, uh, at our booth, many guests, many customers coming from uh, almost everywhere in the world. Technopack is today working 75% for foreigner market and 25% still we are working in Italy. So Italy is still an important country, but the focus of the company is to expand in the world. But to be honest with you, the fact that the first uh, packaging exhibition uh, happened in Italy, which is this exhibition, I think is a good sign also for uh, many customers coming in Italy and buying uh, equipment for us. So during uh, those four days, uh, we've been practically all the time busy. I would like to say the first day we started a little bit uh, slowly. So first day was not as we, we, we could expect. But uh, from Wednesday until, uh, let me say, today around uh, one o'clock, we have had uh, really a lot of things to do. We have been uh, uh, working with our team. We have around uh, 13 people working on the sales department. Almost all the time, all busy to talk with the customers. Yes, we know because we tried to reach you, but it was impossible because your booth was very busy every time. But uh, what about the next exhibitions you are planning to be? Technopark will uh, be in the United States as a next step. So we'll be between 23rd to 26th of October, of October in Pack Expo in Chicago. We go through the ocean with machines to be really on place and to show to the United States customers that Technopack is also there. We have uh, invested a lot of money recently on the last four or five years on that market. We install uh, in three years uh, uh, 10 lines. Mm -hmm. So we have a uh, place now. We know the market, uh, we know the field, uh, we know many customers. And this time on this exhibition, we'll be strongly prepared to show to the market that we are there. So this, is, this time will be the time? We have to, we have to. And um, we have also a good dealer and uh, we'll uh, share the booth uh, with Planet, uh, which is one of the most important uh, accounts that we have today in North America. Got it. Uh, from 8 to 10 of November, we'll also be in the Gulf Food, Gulf Food Manufacturing this time, and uh, Dubai, so the place of your office. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be there also, not with machines, because the Gulf Food uh, is not an exhibition for machines. Yeah. It's an exhibition to create contacts. Uh, and uh, we are dealing with this exhibition since almost 15 years now. It was a uh, golf foot in the past uh, for products and machines together. And then when they split uh, between product and machine and started with the golf food manufacturing, we kept our presence there. So we go there with our entrust, uh, following the mm -hmm. Middle East uh, and also the Far East market. Yeah. Yeah. So those are the next uh, two steps. Uh, and then again, we'll start on 2023 because we know that uh, Interpac is coming on springtime next yeah. year. Yeah. And I guess uh, those uh, two exhibitions plus this one, they are the track to prepare uh, the big event uh, in, Germany in Germany for next year. So let's see you in Dubai at Gulf Manufacturing and maybe also in Pack Expo. Okay. Thank you to Corrado Potzer and thank you to Technopack. Thank you to Sonia, thank you to Zeus. Uh, and uh, of course, we'll be in touch together again on the next step. Of course, thank bye you. Bye-bye.